Hey guys, it's Coach Kenny, and we, uh, meaning the coaches here across at Los Angeles School of Mastery, had our good friend and two-time gold medalist Aaron Caparo come remind us how to row properly. And I learned a lot, lot and so did all the coaches. So this cycle, as you know, we're testing a 6K row. So we're gonna break the whole thing into several skill sessions throughout the cycle. And what you need to know is that we're gonna be focusing on two basic themes. Movement and metrics, the metrics of what's happening on the monitor and being able to understand that and use that information to make your rowing better. But even more important to that is the basis and the foundation of good rowing mechanics. So we're going to have uh, uh, Aaron Caparo, our model rower, demonstrate for us the basic techniques of the row. And Aaron, um, just in a very quick nutshell, what are some of the basics that you reminded us today as far as what's the flow? Of body parts. Yeah, so the easiest way to remember how to do the order of operations, if you will, of the rowing stroke is um, actually we can start all the way here at the catch um, or the bottom position. You just push your legs down, then your body, then arms, arms, body, legs, legs, body, arms, arms, body, legs. So it's a pretty simple flow, and one of the things that Aaron taught us today is how to make connections at different points in this movement. And we're going to reinforce that through a series of drills throughout the cycle. So if you ever see rowing in the workouts, we're gonna be working on specific things that she helped us design uh, as far as like the, the, the program and how to create awareness and execution of those things. Now, the other thing that Aaron's gonna help us understand and uh, the coaches are throughout the cycle is what all the numbers mean. So everything from stroke rate to pace and other things like understanding the damper setting, how to use that, and something called the drag factor. All this is really important information and it's hard to understand all at once, but we're gonna give it to you in small little pieces. At the end, the goal is very simple. Use all the information that Aaron helped us to understand and use that to become better rowers. And the good news about all of this is that the rower, like the run, is no longer the bastardized movement in the middle of a CrossFit workout. Rather, it's a high skill, uh, a metabolic conditioning tool that we're going to understand how to use everything from the monitor to our own bodies to improve our health and fitness. Lastly, Aaron's going to come by as a favor to us and give a free seminar to all of you. And I am thoroughly so excited about that. We'll let you know about when that's coming. And um, you guys need to put it on your calendars as soon as we schedule with her very busy schedule. She's going to come and remind you some of these very basic things that we're going to be reviewing the entirety of the next three months. So, love you guys. Uh, thank you, Aaron Farrow, and we'll see you guys this week. Boom. Thanks, guys. Have fun.